Hello everybody, welcome back to Crafty Canines. I'm Sophie and today we're going to do an unboxing from our Hobby Lobby trip. Hobby Lobby field trip. Uh, that's Timmy over there getting some midnight food. Um, if you guys hear me sniffling, that's just my nose still being mad at me. So we're going to start with the Diamond Dots Premium. So, it's this one right here. It's very light. Okay, let's see here. So we will need the handy dandy box cutter. Now Timmy needs to get some water. <clears throat> so we get the canvas. We get the beads. So the beads of the diamonds. Put that off to the side. This one's just called deer. It doesn't say it on the box, but it is it is called deer. Okay. Let's look at the canvas first, since the uh Toolkit is in with the diamonds. Kind of want to know what's so special about this. Anything special on there? Nope. Um, put that over there. So here is the canvas. This will be so much fun. Okay, so we're gonna roll it the other way around. Undo the the need for it to roll back up. So here we have deer. Move you guys up. Not that much different from the usual. He looks about the same as the normal um, diamond dots canvas. Still. Hmm. Looks about the same, except for the uh, key over here is super teeny tiny. If you look at that, that key is really small compared to the normal ones. I will most likely use a light board for it, just like I do everything else. Because like the, um, let me bring it down. So the uh, H's and the P's over here, there's not much color change in it. So it's like a uh, dark brown and then a reddish dark brown. Uh, the F's and the plus over here. Yeah, there's some... Some parts that are just they look very similar but we will see what it looks like Let's see if we have any ABs it doesn't look like we have any ABs uh, ABs are Aurora Borealis you guys haven't heard that before Let's go ahead and roll this back up but I'm gonna do it all one way Oh, 
That way, whenever I unroll it later to work on it, it won't be anytime soon. Well, it might be soon. I don't know. I don't know if I want to do a... Um, I like to call it a palette cleanse diamond painting in between my big ones. But uh, once I finish the uh, wolf howling at the moon, and I do the post review on that one, then I will be working on one of my craftables. Because I'm uberly excited about those. Oh, let's look at the diamonds. Let's bring you guys up a little bit. There you go. Sorry for all the crinkle crinkles. Oh, well, that, that doesn't help. Okay, we're gonna just do some surgery real quick and just Look, so your normal toolkit with a sparkle pen, a uh, container of wax. I can speak English, I swear. I know that I've been working on foreign languages lately and I keep forgetting little words here and there that are very, very simple. But I can speak English. And then the squishy and the baggies. Well, and the tray. I will, yeah. We get the diamonds. Hi, Tim. You okay? Oh. So let's see here. They're all one strand. No, they're not all one strand. Here are the colors. Now they're not um, DMC, so I'll just show you guys the pretty colors, like a brownish, reddish. -ish. Let me get some light on this. There. Maybe not. My light is being mean right now. Tighten that up a little bit. Can you guys see it? Okay. So this is like a brownish reddish -ish with a stowaway white. Uh, it looks like black. It looks like there's two blacks. Yeah, two blacks. Then we have a gray. Then we have two darkish blue. It's very shiny. And they do have facets. Uh, then we've got more red than brown. We've got a lighter, so maybe a like orangish. And we got a lighter gray. And then we have I'm gonna call it off white. Off white works for me. Okay. And then the next one. We've got uh, another brown. There's uh, like a maroon. We get this pretty bluish ish, greenish ish. Yes, that is a word now. And we've got this blue gray. And we have a lighter blue gray. We have a, a regular brown, as I'm going to call it. This one is... Well, there's two of these. Yes, two of these. So these are almost navy purple. Very navy 
It's very, very dark maybe. We got a yellow, and then a dark brown. Now you guys probably not see these very well. Because it's always easier to see colors in person. Yeah. Oh, that's a nice blue. So we've got a blue green, maybe. Yeah, maybe blue green. We have a dark gray, a peach, a uh, lighter brown, a darker peach. There's a darker one that, uh, I'm gonna call this, I don't know what I'm gonna call this. You know those, uh, uh, clay pots. It's kind of like that. Then we have some more brown. And then lastly, we have white with a brown hiding in it. So this one had a stowaway that went over to the uh, number one color. And in order to compensate, it grabbed one from over here. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. Alright, so let's go ahead and cut these away. They will cooperate. That's not them that needs to cooperate, it's my table. Um, I have my table at a tilt right now because I was diamond tamed. And because I'm lazy and I'm planning on going back to diamond painting here in a little bit, I uh, left it in the diamond painting position. So, there we go. No, we're gonna cooperate. No, no, you cooperate. Slide these ones back in here. Maybe. Just to make it look pretty full, we'll put the toolkit back in here. And then we will roll it back. And that is all for this one. I will be doing more uh, unboxings from the ones we had that. I picked up from uh, Hobby Lobby on our field trip. Oh, are you being a pain now? You are being a pain now. Canvas. Then name. There we go. Okay. So I will be doing the two Diamond Art Clubs that I got here in a couple minutes. I'm not sure if I'm gonna upload them all at one time. I might. Maybe. All right. Uh, happy crafting, everybody. And happy Monday. And for all of you that have subscribed, thank you so much. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.